please subscribe math.com for any query, comment or email. Hello everyone. Our today's topic is a very important topic of the matrices that is the additive identity of a matrix. For the time being, just forget about the word matrix. You must have the concept of the additive identity. Just recall the concept of the additive identity in case of the real numbers. It was stated as a sta additive identity basically is an identity property of addition that refers to the state when 0 is added to any real number, then that number remains the same. It means that 0 is not affecting the value of that real number. Okay, let's say we have A is any real number. Okay, it could be any real number. And if we want to find the additive identity in this case, what you must have, you must have to add 0 to this real number and the answer must be the real number actually. It means that 0 is not impacting the real number in any case, it means that the 0 is the additive identity of that number. Okay, so in this case, this is called the additive identity. 0 is called the, called the additive identity. So, it is not the only case when you are talking about the real numbers. It is also the case when you talk about the matrices. Matrices consist of multiple elements. Okay, that are arranged in rows and columns. When we talk about the additive identity of a matrix, we must consider the same situation. That is, let's say we have a, any matrix, let A be any matrix. When we add a zero matrix of the same order to it, then we must get the matrix A as it is. It means that zero matrix is not affecting the matrix A. So let A be any matrix and a zero matrix of same order. It means that the two matrices, matrices must be of the same order. It means that they must have same number of rows and columns. Okay. So when we add, if we write it mathematically as when we add a matrix with a zero matrix, we must get the matrix as it is. Or if we add 0 to any, any matrix, we must get the, the same matrix as it is. It means that the, that the 0 matrix is the additive identity here. Okay, As in real numbers, 0 is the ad additive identity. So similarly, in case of the matrices, we have this 0 as the additive identity of a matrix. So it is called additive identity of a matrix as it this is just because of the fact that it is not affecting the original original matrix in any way. Okay. So it is called the additive identity of a given matrix A. Okay. Let's say we have a matrix A of the order 2 into 2 having 2 rows and 2 columns. And a zero matrix is a matrix having all the elements zero. Okay. So these are the two matrices. So uh, in order to apply the condition of the additive identity, we must add the two matrices in order to check whether it is an additive identity or not. Okay. So we have to add both these matrix together as by keeping in mind the rules of addition of the matrices as we have already discussed. So A plus O is equals to A is a matrix 1, 4, 6, 8 plus O is the 0 matrix. Okay, we will add according to the uh, uh, according to uh, the uh, rules of matrix addition. We will add the corresponding elements as 1 plus 0, 6 plus 0, 4 plus 0 and 8 plus 0. Okay, what we will get? We will get 1, 4, 6 and A. Now check is this equal to the matrix A? Yes, it is equal to the matrix A. This means that the condition is satisfied. This means that this matrix O is the additive identity of a given matrix. Okay. 
okay we have to check it also that if if we add the uh, zero matrix to the given matrix it must give uh, it must give us the same value so we will apply as o plus a okay so o will be here as it is the zero matrix and the original matrix is 1 4 6 8 and again we will apply the same rules of addition as 0 plus 1 0 plus 6 Zero plus four and zero plus eight. Okay, what we will get? One, four, six, eight. So we have got the same matrix. This means that the condition is satisfied. So it is clear that A plus A plus zero matrix is equals to A or zero matrix plus A. They are the same. It means the order doesn't matter here. Whether you add zero matrix. to the uh, to any given matrix or to you can add the given matrix to the zero matrix it means that the zero matrix that is the identity additive identity of the matrix has not changed the value of the actual matrix so this was all about what is the additive identity of a matrix so keep in mind that additive identity is always zero in case of real numbers it is a it's a single element or a one or a single real number and in case of the matrices it consists of the um uh, of rows and columns with multiple elements and all those elements must be zero and those elements have no effect on the given matrix to which we are added adding so that's all, that was all about additive identity of a matrix thank you thank you for watching if you like this video please don't forget to subscribe our channel math.com for more updates thank you